Defense will shoot it in. Back in the L.A. zone. Back to the point it comes. Shot oh, off the defenseman's stick. Loose puck in front. Simpson caught with his head down. Oh, that's not his style. Really got his bell run. That's got to hurt. What are you thinking of, a grocery list? In here, all right? And keep your voice down, please. You rigged this guy's suspension. You thought you'd set up this big fight so the game would be on TV. You have no idea what I was thinking. As usual. Look, I have very good reasons for doing what I did, okay? Okay, why? Why would you create some stupid showdown where somebody could get killed? I did, first of all, nobody ever gets hurt in a hockey fight, Shell. And I did it because this is a small market team with a small market mind. All right, the steelheads are invisible outside of Canada, and this franchise will die if I do not build the brand. That's why. Even if somebody gets hurt. Uh, come, uh, come on. Look, it, it's hockey, Shell. It is a violent game. But it is not a game about violence. What you're doing isn't hockey anymore. God, it's ancient Rome. It's, it's Nero and the gladiators. <laughs> hey, okay, you want to talk about Nero? Y you take a look at his reincarnation standing behind the steelheads bench out there, all right? What does Strand have to do with this? The guy wants my job. That's what? This guy, this guy had this plan. So this isn't about the steelheads at all. No, this is about positioning. This is about career. Well, yes, because I am the only way that this team will survive. Okay? Can you imagine what would happen if this guy took over? Whatever it is, it is not worth people getting hurt. Hey, you know, what just, what are you for? Uh, hey, how did you find out about this anyway? Is that really important, Brett? Well. I have a hunch it might be, yeah. I smell Colleen all over this. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, whatever. I can handle her. But it makes me wonder, why would she do that? Why would she tell you? Maybe because this is important. <laughs> I'll tell you why. She did it so that she could use you against me. No, that is not true. She didn't even know about it! I helped her to find out! You what? I helped her. Well... You always talk about family to me. You know, and how I left the family, and how I, how I, how I failed the family. But you know, maybe family life, maybe that works two ways, Sha. You know, and maybe, maybe you owe me a little something. You know, maybe just a touch of loyalty, maybe. What is that supposed to mean? You helped her. You helped Colleen against me. You were wrong. What the hell does that have to do with anything? Chip in fighting for it behind the LA goal. We're off to a slow start. Where the hell is Maplethorpe? On the bench. Yeah, I know he's on the bench. I want to know why he's not on the ice. He has an injured hand. No, I'll tell you what he has. He has a contract with the Steel Heads that says that he plays hockey. Now you play him. As you say. As I say. 22, go! Here we go. Maplethorpe and Dusky are at it. Come on, Maplethorpe. It's time. I got no problem with you. You get the biggest problem you ever had. And you got two minutes. Two minutes! Let's they can't the wait to get it going. Finally, the action starts. <laughs> Hamilton with the man advantage. Here's Maplethorpe. Splits the defense and scores! A power play goal for Maplethorpe. Makes it one to nothing for the Steelheads. Frank Dusky in the penalty box, costs his team a goal, and that is going to make him mad. Chicken, goat. This is scary for you, isn't it? No, not scary. It's infuriating. You know, with Jenny gone, my memories are all I have left. 
I don't live in the past. But as long as I have my memories, then I have the place I grew up in. And the place where Grey Cup Day is the best day of the year. And where everything went dead silent at 11 a.m. every November the 11th. You know, I think this is probably just a natural part of aging. Yeah, and aging is a natural part of dying. Well, if it is memory loss, there are drugs you can take for that. I'm not a man who suffers from memory loss. And the only drugs I take are made of hops and barley. I think you should go see Dr. Newman. No, don't want to. You have to. It's a rider in the insurance policy. Annual medicals for all staff and personnel. For you. What was the name of that doctor again? <laughs> they want you to destroy this man, Maplethorpe. They want your spirit to soar. They want you to be free. I am being free. Even I'm nodding off and I don't sleep at night. What are you talking about? We're seconds away from the brawl of the century here, Al. This is going to be on every highlight reel in the nation. Oh, my, your affiliates are going to murder you. You missed this thing, I'm telling you. You told me there'd be blood out there. Maplethorpe's backed off every time Jesky went near him. Are you kidding? The guy's out there. He's cruising like a tiger shark right this second. I gave you your first job out of college. Without me, you'd be a weather girl in Scranton, Pennsylvania. You know. <sighs> but put us on the feed, okay? Just put us on your network feed, okay? We're between periods in Detroit. I'll give you five minutes. Okay. I, I didn't. Okay. Black Ryan Hamilton and Dusky runs the Grizzly Trombley. Maple Thorpe's got no choice. He's got to do something. Here they go. Maple Thorpe and Dusky gonna go at it. Oh man! Here's Dusky. Grab him. There's a shot. He's all you got. He comes back with a good hand and the crowd loves that. He's too good. Between these two guys, they obviously don't like each other one bit. Yeah, come on, Todd! Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be good for you! They are still going at it. Todd, Maple Corp, and Frank Dusky exchanging blows. We'd heard about this one before the game. Both players joined earlier. A goal goaded into by Maple Corp. He got Dusky to take the penalty, and now it looks like Dusky's trying to get a little revenge. Todd Maplethorpe, they call him Terminal Todd. Here is Frank Dusky now, his shirt is off, both players going at him, exchanging right hands. Big right hand there by Maplethorpe, and he cut Dusky's Does not look good, and a hush is now falling.